First, pull the ruler to ensure that the electrodes are evenly distributed. Unfold all cables and straighten them all. Unfold all cables on the other side as well. Insert all electrodes equally into the ground and connect the electrodes and cables. Find the centralized interface on the main frame and connect to the front end communication of the multi-channel electrode converter. One end of the cable is plugged into channel 1 to 30, and the data measured on this line is 1 to 30. The other end of the cable is plugged into channel 31 to 60, and the data measured on this line is 31 to 60. Connect the 12V battery to the 600 VDC boost power supply. Next, connect the 600 VDC boost power supply to the mainframe. Turn on the mainframe and multi-channel electrode converter. Do not turn on the 600 VDC boost power supply for now. Before measuring, it is necessary to perform a self-check on all channel numbers. Click on measure and all channels will be automatically measured. Obtain a 2D map after the measurement is completed. Finally, it is necessary to use Freeze 2D INVX inversion on the computer to obtain the resistivity after the inversion is completed. The corresponding material classification can be determined by referring to this resistivity value.